My shirt is really high. So we had the SID Display Week 2019 here with a JBD. And uh, hi, so who are you? Hi, my name is Anderson Liu. I am the business director of JBD. Hi. Hi, I'm uh, Chi Ming Li. I'm the founder and CEO of JBD. Hello. Hi, my name is Jing Ji. I'm the director of IC of JBD. And uh, right here, we're seeing your display in action. Yes. Uh, here. We're showing a uh, light up panel of 720p, 5 micron pitch green panel. And the, this is a neutral density here to prevent uh, the eye get burned because it has extremely high brightness. Whoa. So this could go up to uh, 2 million nits. We 2 million nits? 2 yes. million nits, yes. yes. Last year we demonstrated uh, uh, 1 million nits, and I think we won the Aizun uh, Most Innovation Award. And this year we're coming out with the 2 million nits, and we believe this is the highest in the world. How you do 2 million? This is a wafer level technology. There's no phosphor, no uh, pick and place, no mass transfer, no quantum dots. Everything is made by um, silicon and compound semiconductor like uh, Allen gap or indium gallium nitride phosphide. So, so this is your wafer right here? Yes, so each one of the panel here is the uh, 720p 5000 dpi panel that you just saw uh, and this is how they look on a 4 inch wafer so this is each one is a 720 5000 dots per inch um, yep. extremely high pixel density yes actually, 5000 is very high actually we have something even higher on this side we have 2.5 inch uh, uh, i'm sorry uh, 2.5 micron in pitch that's 10,000 dpi, 10,000 dot per inch. I think we should light it up. Can you light it up? Yes. yes. It's extremely bright. How bright does it go? Uh, at this level, it can go up to 1 million nits. So I need to wear my sunglasses, right? Uh, pretty much. Yeah. And this is actually the world record. Nobody has ever demonstrated for that dimension, for that brightness. What do you say? How many nits? 1 million nits for 2.5 micron pitch. Is this full brightness or not? Oh, this is only a few percentage of the total power. It's very bright. So you have something you can cover it also, so we can, oh, shall I turn my shutter speed down? So what's the resolution here? The resolution is very high, it's 4K by 5K. 4K by 5K? Yes. In a, how many inch diagonal? Uh, it's a 12 millimeter by nine millimeter is roughly half inch point, point six. 0.6 inch point, point 0.6 inch you have a 4k by 5k yes um i think that's a good idea uh to do 4k display in a very small right yep. yes small is the new big that's our slogan what is we, the what is the idea why you do uh, such high resolution so small so each tiny panel only in uh, uh, the weight, the total weight is, um, is less than a gram, but these combined with properly designed optics can give you a large vision. I'm talking about 100 inch display in an AR glass. So small is the new big. So this is for the AR market? Yes. Augmented reality? Yes. The Not one the of VR, the VR, only AR. Uh, I, we, you can use it in VR. Uh, certainly they have more advantage in AR domain. Isn't it a little bit dangerous to have 2 million nits in the eye? Well, the uh, customers need something even higher because their optics requires a very high power uh, light output. So this will go to a, a waveguide and, and through a back to the eye? Yeah, a series of uh, optical um, devices. To make it look like a big screen? Big screen. Small Do you have a customer already, or what is the status of the company? We have uh, customers, um, but unfortunately we couldn't disclose Top the... Top secret customer. E exactly. So where are you based, the company? Well, we're based in Shanghai and Hong Kong. Uh, our manufacturer and research uh, team is in Shanghai. And what's in Hong Kong? Uh, Hong Kong is our headquarter and also our sales and business team. And uh, uh, what's your job? My job is... Um, I'm in charge of finding the uh, particular gel IC and... Developing uh, this IC? Yeah. This is an IC? What is this? Is this display or IC? What is this? 
the you look at the bottom, there's a silicon uh, CMOS, um, there's a silicon substrate on the top. We have uh, three five semiconductor integrated. We when you call say it 35, what do you say? Three, uh, five? three five. Three five and three nitride. That's a, a type of uh, semiconductor. Again, Which is it very common or what? What is? Oh, this is a uh, very matured uh, materials, um, but it's very reliable, very efficient. We're using monolithic technology, something like uh, DRAM or CMOS, uh, wafer level. There's no need to pick and place, no quantum dots. So one wafer like this is very expensive, or how, how is it? Oh, there's a extremely affordable, much cheaper. Affordable. Extremely affordable. Much, much cheaper than what? Much cheaper than Alcos, than DLP, than OLEDs. Um, really? Yes. Affordable is a good idea. That's right. For so consumer electronics, this is very good. Um, affordable is good, uh, but also higher brightness is important. Yes. yes. Smaller size is important as well. Smaller DPI? Uh, more DPI. Actually. More DPI, more yeah. DPI. Smaller, smaller pitch. pitch. Smaller pitch. Yes. Um, uh, how about full color and everything? What's the status? We do have a bicolor here. Uh, it's a red and green. Maybe put a yeah. filter on it. Um, we do have a three color in development, and we are planning on pushing out later, yeah. later next month. Yeah. Uh, and we'll definitely have it out by the end of the year for three color display. So what am I looking at? Yellow and red, or what is it? Green. This is or? green and red. Green and red. Yes. What's missing? Uh, blue. The blue. The blue. Ah, blue. Blue is a challenge or not? Or you know what to do? Yes, uh, we know what to do. In uh, late June or maybe early July, we'll release all RGB color on the same panel. Because your logo is blue, so you, you better know how to make <laughs> yeah, it. Yeah, we right? have to have yeah. blue, yes. And uh, uh, do you use any, um, uh, what's it called, uh, quantum dots? Or what do you, how do you do things? This, everything is uh, semiconductor. Uh, there's no quantum dots, no liquid crystal, no organic LED. Um, is that cool? I mean, the, anybody else? How, do you think you're the best, or what's the status? I think we're the, the top uh, micro LED company. We not only demonstrate very high DPI, small pitch, but also extremely high brightness. And actually, we just released our 5,000 DPI or 5 micron pitch panels. They come in RGB separate panels, they are off the shelf. Uh, I can buy one? Yes. How does it work? Like you're Just selling them to who? Swap your card, then we'll sell you one. But where do you sell them? To who? We sell to a lot of AR customers, a um, lot of developers, but uh, couldn't dis disclose their names for now. So what's the challenge? Um, how, how to develop something like this? Oh, you mean a Java asset back plane? Yeah. Like, uh, uh, can you explain something about the, the challenges every day? Uh, what's happening? Like, uh, how do you get the happening is about the challenge is about the refresh rate for the AR VR glasses. Uh, some customer customers maybe require very high refresh rate up to one K. One K. Yeah. One K hertz. Yeah. But I think one hundred twenty hertz would be okay. We well, can do two hundred and forty here, like the panel we are showing is here. Is it two hundred forty now? Two hundred forty. Yes. Really? Yes. This is doing 240? Yes. 240. But the video itself playing is now 240 hertz. You need yes. a special camera to record 240. Yes, that's right. You, oh, you can speed it up in editing or something like that. Um, so, so what's next? Because you hear the SID Display Week. Last year you get the uh, iZone Award. That's right. And what's next? Well, we are continue to release our new product, support our customers, and continue to push the limit, continue to improve the quantum efficiency, and continue to make big screen using small panels. And you totally will have full color, like uh, this, this bird there, uh, red, green, and blue, I mean, the other yep. thing? We will release that in the summer of this year. We are in the summer nearly. Oh, there's Next this month? Still yeah, Two months like later? A, yeah, early so, July. So you're working fast, yeah. or how how big is the team? Is it a secret or? Uh, it's not a secret. We have a hundred about a hundred people now. We have expand. We have doubled the people from last year, and we plan to double the people by the end of the year, getting ready for production uh, soon. So how do you make a wa uh, wafer? What you call a fab for this? 
Is that your secret sauce? You, 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 That's you're, developing this, you're developing this fab? All I can tell you is monolithic. You can think about the way where DRAM or uh, CPU is made. Uh, this, is, this is standard semiconductor processing. It's kind of like printing kind of or? Uh, plasma edge, lithography, um, thin film coating. But everything is done in a wafer level. How many are there in one wafer? This is about 90 dice per wafer. And how many I can use? How many are good? Above 70% yield. That's pretty high, no? Uh, we're still improving. So you can go up to what, 80, 90? We're happy now at the 70, but I think we can push it down, uh, push it up to 80%. And how yield. do you do that? Just uh, continuous development and uh, um, hard work. <laughs> hard work, yes. So, um, many, many details. Do you think uh, AR is going to be huge? Do you think a lot of people are going to use that? We do believe AR is huge. Um, think about this. Instead of using a big TV, you only use a tiny small glass and you can see a large screen and also a lot more function added on. The nice thing about that, you can add um, reality and virtual reality together. This is, um, I, we do believe this is going to be the next big thing. So do you yeah. think the app developers will keep up with your innovation? Because you need to have a whole ecosystem of AR application killer apps, right? Uh, can you also make those, or you other people will do them? We're the uh, panel company. We don't do contents. We don't do apps. We support hardware company. Of course, they're software company and content company. Everybody have to get together to make it happen. Because uh, uh, it would actually free us from the phones a little bit if we have AR. Yeah, definitely. We can keep the, yep. the phone in the pocket. Yep. That's right. And then we can uh, focus on what's important, which yes. is. Uh, That's right talking with other yes. people, right? Yes. And just on the side, maybe checking what's happening. Yes. Right? Yeah, exactly. So next year, when, when? This year? Next year, we're going to attend the uh, SID again at uh, San Francisco. And early next year, we will be in Las Vegas CES. And uh, everybody is welcome to go to our booth and see our new progress and improvements. What you will promise to have for CES? CES will release the 10,000 DPI or 2.5 micron uh, panels as a standard product. And uh, when you talk about 2.5 micron, that's every pixel? Every single pixel. Micron, yes. And every single one is perfect or there's some defect and you have a trick to hide the defective ones and <laughs> then you can't see them and then everything looks perfect? Because it's a monolithic technology, so the defect is very, very low. The uniformity is extremely high. Uh, certainly, there are few dead pixels. Right now, we're on the order of a PPM level, but so we're improving it, hopefully, to get down to PPB level. PPM, it means one per million, or what does it mean? One per million, yes. And PPB is one per billion? That's right. And it's possible to do that? One per billion, that means no defect, no? Uh, there's, only, there's only... If you count 1,000 panels, that's one billion pixels. Oh, cool. All right, that's awesome. So. Um, let's see. Let's see if this video can get double as many views as last year, right? All right. Okay. Cool. Because cool. now it's du double as yeah. two million nits, so it should be yeah. two million views. <laughs> cool. Can you just?